Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing a new release video. Um, our new releases will be up Friday night at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time this week. Um, I just got back from vacation on Tuesday and so I had very limited time to get ready for all of this. So yeah, there's not as many as I wanted, but that's okay. We have a few weeks and then we'll have more stuff coming out. Um, and I'm actually working on some very special things. Um, so I'm really excited to show you guys those as well, but let's jump into the new releases. If you guys are in our Facebook group, you know that I've wanted to do one reformatted kit, one new kit, and then glitter headers. Um, this week. I've had glitter headers before. I actually brought them out, I think it was in September of last year, um, and they were there until I think February, and then I stopped selling them. I I closed the shop and completely forgot about them, to be honest with you guys. So I'm bringing them back um, with a few different colors as well, but I'm going to show you guys the first is the reformatted kit. So technically this isn't a reformat because I'm using different paper. Well, I'm using a few different papers, but I kind of mixed and matched the old one with the new one. Um, I really wanted to bring back Merbabe, so I'm going to show you guys the full boxes first. So here are the full boxes. So we have, um, let's zoom you guys in just a little bit. So the things that I brought from the old kit, you guys said you liked the chunky glitter from the old kit better than the glitter that I had from this kit, so I decided to go back with the old chunky glitter um, and then I have you know some really pretty colors it's more of like a purpley teal spread which I really like so that's the full boxes here is the header sheet here is the ombre heart checklists here's the labels sheet and then here is the two-page kit that you can buy as well. So the quote box says, she is tossed by the waves but does not sink. And I really love this. And then I love this washi. It's beautiful. So that is the new Mer Babe kit. I hope you guys enjoy the reformat for this one. I actually like really love this one more than I like the regular Mer Babe. I just think that the colors are beautiful and a lot more vibrant than the old one. And I like that it gives you a little bit of variety and they're not all the same type of box. Um, and then I'm going to show you guys the personal size kit. So again, it's our regular personal size format. Um, I have two glitter half boxes and then the half box that matches this. And then here's the washi sheet. So those two as well. So let's get into, I'm going to show you guys the glitter headers really quickly. So here's our old glitter headers. Um, I really like these because there's seven of the same colors. So you guys can get this and use one color for the whole week. So this is the first one. I'm a huge fan of the chunky, chunky glitter. So there's that one. And then I came out with a blue and green color scheme as well to try and match some more kits and stuff like that. And then I came out with a pink one as well. So the next one I'll probably come out with um, next three releases will be like purples. Um, purples, maybe purples and, I don't know, oranges or orange and purple or orange and reds. I'm going to come out with a bunch of different color schemes, but I wanted to start out with just a few, um, just so you guys can get a feel of the glitter headers. And if you guys like them, um, I can always come out with more color schemes as well. Okay, so the last thing is our new kit that we have this week. Um, this one is probably one of my favorite kits that I've come out with in a very long time. Um, this is our rind kit. I don't know if I'm gonna call it that. Um, it might be different than that. Um, so I'm just gonna start with the two page kit on this one. So here is the first page. I can't get over this. If you guys were on my Periscope, I was like almost peeing my pants because every time I look at this, I think it's so funny and so clever. Um, but it says, y'all gonna make me lose my rind. Not mine, rind, because it's a watermelon kit. So I think it was Joanne who is a active member of our Facebook group and of our shop. She's a huge supporter of mine and she's so great. She 
re has been requesting a watermelon kit, I think since like February. Okay, not that late. But she's been requesting one for a very long time and I just couldn't find anything that I really liked that people didn't have already. I wanted it to be different, I wanted it to be fun, I wanted it to be bright. Um, <laughs> you definitely get that. So this is a little bit non-traditional watermelon. I mean, you still have the watermelon paper and stuff, but it's a lot different with the colors. So you have a lot darker of a red, you have the hot, the hot pink, you have the purple, you have the lime green. You know, I love the accent of the purple. I think that it gives it, um, it makes it a lot different than all the other watermelon kits out there. So there's that. I'll show you guys. Here's the labels. Really pretty. Here is the Ombre Heart Checklist. Oh my goodness, I didn't even see that there, I need to snag that. So there's that. Here is the headers. Doo -doo -doo. And then here is the full boxes. So again, I told you it was a little bit different, but still has a traditional feel to it. Um, at least like with this and like these papers and this, but I love like these kind of cool um, take on watermelon. So 